Section 1. Aphasia and Technology In this section, learn about aphasia. See how technology can help you communicate. What is aphasia? Aphasia affects language. Aphasia can make it hard to understand speech. Speak, read, write and use numbers. Your own aphasia is unique to you. Aphasia does not affect your intellect. One third of stroke survivors have aphasia. Technology can help you communicate. Communication is more than just talking. Communication can be writing, gestures, pictures, facial expressions, and speaking. Technology can help communication. Try different things and see what works for you. Try using a video call. On a video chat, you can gesture. You can type keywords. You can show facial expressions. Try using pictures. Take or show pictures to help communicate. Show photos of places you visited to your friends. Use a map to show where you went on holiday. Show a YouTube video in a conversation about your favourite music. Use a film website in a conversation about what film you want to see. Technology can help with reading and writing. You can use text-to-speech, which will read documents aloud. Use predictive text on phones and tablets. This helps by guessing what word or phrase you will write next. You might find it hard to use technology now you have aphasia. Technology can change quickly. You can use a computer, laptop, tablet or smartphone. People who design technology may not think about people's different needs. It might be hard to remember passwords. Learn at your own pace. You do not need to learn everything at once. Take things one step at a time. It might take time to build your confidence. It can help to practice with a family member or friend.